What's going on guys, Creepsto here, and we got some new chest available today with the new patch, and of course, we gotta buy them because we gotta buy everything that Dota throws out, but uh, we have five new chests, and if you guys didn't notice, they released the catalog, and in that catalog, they show different items you can buy, just kind of like last year, and you'll receive a code for a chest inside, and I thought the only way to receive these items right here were to buy those little statues they had, some $30 statues, they had Doom, Slark, uh, Crystal Maiden um, they had a couple other people that had Tiny and somebody else so I thought that was the only way to get them those items were 30 bucks but uh, come to find out they released some chest and you're able to just go ahead and purchase them they do have the chest for 3.99 it's a Trove Carafe I don't know if I'm saying that correctly but it doesn't matter and they're all immortal items and the bonus very rare reward is this doom link courier which looks pretty awesome now another thing that came out with this chest is you can either buy the chest regular for $3.99 or you can go ahead and uh, buy a chest that has a signature inside and you can pick any signature you want they got English Russian Chinese or Korean so it's an extra bucks uh, an extra buck if you do want um, somebody's signature on the chest um, with the item that you get so it's just up to you it's preference uh, it doesn't really matter to me I don't really care for signatures unless they were like player signatures um, but uh, either way the most important thing is the items that are in the chest so uh, pretty cool things uh, first we got the shadow shaman item which uh, I mean the big part of this immortal effect is gonna be um, that he can I think it's like it turns them into like a little ram or something like that. They have the mortal totem for uh, Earthshaker, which is pretty cool. It has an effect uh, kind of like his 1099 set. I think the EG set, I believe, that uh, like throwing out your Fisher. It has a special effect. Uh, the Empyrean Immortal Staff for Skywrath Mage. This has a kinetic gem inside. I'm curious to what actually, you know, what what's the effect on this if they are just like the TI Immortals, which I'm pretty sure they are. And uh, next is a Severing Crest Immortal Helm for Razor, which uh, looks pretty cool. Yeah, very different. Um, probably, you know, the better looking uh, Razor Helms that he has. I, I'm not too big of a Razor player, so um, don't really care too much for it. Uh, but I, what I am more excited for out of this whole chest is a Pale Mausoleum. I don't know if I said that correctly, but the Immortal Tombstone for Undying. Uh, one of my favorite heroes to play, and I'm sure it's going to have some pretty cool animated zombies when you throw out his tome. So this is the item I was most excited about uh, when it came to this chest. I was going to buy some of those $30 items just to get the chest, but now that I don't have to, and we can go ahead and just pur purchase the chest just like this, I'm very excited to start using that because Undying, one of my favorite heroes, and of course the Doomling Immortal Courier, which is just really awesome. This is... I don't know, one of the coolest like player couriers I've seen. The Pudgling is pretty cool. Um, but out of all the heroes that have, you know, couriers made for them or made towards them, uh, this is probably one of my favorite ones. Looks really cool. So let's go ahead and go ahead and buy one up. I'm not I don't really care too much for the autographs, not something I really care too much for, so let's go ahead and see what we get here. Alright, first off, I should just not even buy anything else. Not just plain. Uh, receive the inscribed pale, the mausoleum, immortal tombstone. That's pretty sweet. So, godlike sprees. I don't know how many godlike sprees I could go with Undying, but um, that's pretty cool. Let's go ahead and. I should have bought all the chests all at once, but it's alright. We'll just go back to here. So, we got one of those opened, and uh, let's go ahead get another one I really do want to get this Earthshaker totem it looks pretty cool I don't know kinda of missed the 54321 thing alright the inscribed severing crest let's see what gem is inside barracks destroyed okay that goes good with razor so uh, especially with his Aghanim's, uh ultimate so that, that's that's a gem that's pretty appropriate for him so uh, pretty cool I'm pretty sure it looks awesome in game so uh, let's go ahead and where are we going? Back to treasures. Error occurred. No, we do not want a compendium. We do not want a compendium. All right, let's go ahead and open up another one. Hopefully we get lucky and get a doomling. If not, it's all right. 
we are happy with the tombstone. That, that was the item I'm most excited to use. Inscribed Lamb of the Slaughter. Okay, so it doesn't turn him into a little ram. It's a lamb. I'm not sure if they're kind of the same, but well. Uh, <laughs> weapon for Shadow Shaman. That's a pretty cool item. I like to use Shadow Shaman a lot. Uh, we got to get back over here. And uh, hopefully we get the totem next. If I was to get the totem right now and the doomling, I'd just stop. I would even get the Skywrath Mage one because... I don't play too much Skywrath unless it has a really cool effect or something. Oh, and look, uh, I think we ended up getting the Doomling except two. And cool. All right, we got it. Now, should I even open the last one? Because that was probably my least favorite one out of all the ones I was going to get. And this is pretty cool. A really sweet curve. I haven't gotten none of the very rare items in you know the last few two three chests, but I'm really excited that I got this one. I'm not sure if it's like a real common drop that a lot of people are getting it probably, but um, either way, all the other ones I've never got them before. And okay, the gem in this one is a gold urn. Uh, not too bad. Um, you know, whatever. I was hoping for a earth shaker gem, something you know more relevant to them. Let's see. Here we go again. All right, should we get an autograph one for the last one? All right, if there's anyone that I'm gonna get an autograph from, at least an item that has autograph, it's gotta be to somebody that makes me laugh and I enjoy uh, watching their their commentary, and that's gotta be Bruno. Bruno is entertaining like no other. So let's go ahead and get one of these autograph ones. Why not? Let's see what we, what happens. At least we'll have something with Bruno's autograph since we got the last one. We got the rare drop. I'm happy with that. So weapon slot for Skywrath Mage, Immortal Staff. And, all right, Emperor the Kinetic Gem inside. And, of course, uh, autograph by Bruno. And you know what? Before we leave, I want to go into... I want to go into this game and check out the, the zombies. That's what I was most excited for checking out mm, we'll check out the courier too while we're in here before we go oh I have this screen all full huh let me go ahead and take this off real quick I didn't even notice that all right undying ability at that uh, global items nope we don't want that Whoa! stop messing up on me and where are you oh there it was all right, let's go ahead and start this up. This was, I don't know, when I first saw the item, this was I most excited for. Dude, why'd you buy the courier? Did you hear that I was going to buy the courier? All right. I'd get ready if I were you. Here he is. <laughs> this is so freaking awesome. This doomling is, is a boss. All right. Now let's get to the Undying Tombstone. Let's go ahead and back out real quick. And I guess I gotta go where the creeps are, right? I know I'm making this way longer than it needs to be, but if you guys are done watching the video, you guys go ahead and click out if that's what you came for, but I want to see how this tombstone looks like before I get out of here. In case anyone is wondering, because I was really excited for it, so. Look at this guy. This guy's awesome. Come on, buddy. Look at little Doom. This is, this is awesome. It's like Doom had a baby. He tried to deny it, say it was Undying's baby. Doom said it didn't look like him, but clearly this looks like Doom's son. Alright, enough messing around. I guess I could put the zombies up. I don't think no one's gonna. There's gonna be no zombies climbing around since there's no enemies, so. We'll just wait till the creeps come. I've calculated who will win to a 99.93% Doop, 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 doop. Alright. Here they go. Let's see how these zombies look. Alright. Sweet. Yeah, they're pretty cool. I like them. They look like a whole bunch of, uh, uh, Clinks. Clinks' brothers and sisters. Looks pretty cool. But anyways, guys, that was it for this video. Hopefully you enjoyed watching it. Uh, let me know in the comments down below what are your favorite items out of the whole bunch. Uh, what items did you get? Did you guys get a immortal 
um, Immortal. I'm talking about the Doomling. Did you guys get the Doomling? Uh, and if so, uh, let me know what you guys think about the chest. What's your favorite item out of the five? Mine, personally, was the Undying. And uh, let me know what yours guys was. Don't forget to subscribe for more videos if you guys like these kind of videos. And uh, make sure to subscribe to my Twitch, YouTube, and uh, follow me on Twitter if you guys like to. And uh, until next time, guys, I'll see you guys later. Peace.